This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news. All right, so we got Nicki Minaj at the Essence Festival. Um, she appears, well, first she had uh, Lil Wayne. She had uh, Birdman and everybody come out and support her at the Essence Festival. Now, one of the most famous songs she's on is Monster, okay? And she refused to perform it. Um... She performed, Do We Have a Problem? We Go Up, Did It On Them, Breeze in the Trap. But she wouldn't perform Monster, and people were wondering why. Um, people were saying that uh, she has some bad blood between Kanye West at the moment. Also, I don't know. I, think, I don't think it has anything to do with Kanye just doing a song with Cardi B. But because uh, Cardi B just released a song called Hot-ish. With a uh, little Dirk that's out, but uh, Monster, she says we're not gonna, we're not gonna. Uh, what did she say? Monster though, a monster though. We don't f with those clowns. Uh, now that could be okay. So she definitely has a problem with Rick Ross because Rick Ross said a lot of things about her when she broke, her and Meek Mill broke up. He blamed her for a lot of the stuff. I mean, for some reason, he took a stance on that relationship. I don't know why. Yeah, so she definitely doesn't mess with Rick Ross anymore. And she... I think everybody has a problem with Kanye at one point now. Because, like, he he, he uh, voices his opinion and downplays a lot of people. And then tries to come back, go back on his word. Like, Kid Cudi right now has... And him just have their problems they'll probably be cool again as they usually work things out but um yeah Kanye's going through his Kanye stuff uh Blueface responds to Christian Rock saying uh she's in the club with Five Year Foreign he says uh we were never in a relationship she didn't hold up to her bargain blah 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 whatever you know now, now she's on Zeus and she's doing she has her own She's on some like bad girls type of club show. Um, this girl also, for some reason, fought Blueface's mother and his sister, which is weird. And uh, Blueface's mom reacted and said, I've always taught uh, to never let, let's see, let him catch you talking or entertaining no other man. Or that would be the end. My son have problems sharing anything. I don't know what she's talking She, she doesn't make any sense honestly um so that's that but we already you know that's how we you if you have a girl writing your name in blood on walls and stealing your your car and everything i mean <laughs> it seems a little toxic okay i mean you know maybe he likes that i don't know he's probably toxic himself then we got uh britney renner she now she sat down with kevin samuels and agreed with a lot of things he's saying now i get what she's saying in this video she's talking about Women don't have to be submissive and don't fall for, you know, don't like women shouldn't have to be submissive. And she's right about that because submissive in the sense where, you know, women, women do have a voice and women. I mean, it's more of a 50 50 thing now in life. You know, this isn't 1940, you know, 19, you know, this is, women have rights, you know, women have women, women's voices are being heard and women should be able to it, it, it's more like a partnership now and that's kind of what she's just saying here like uh relationships are a partnership and both people should have a voice in the relationship absolutely but when she was sitting down with kevin samuel she was agreeing with she would she should have said more of that with him so they could have hashed that out because like that should have been something that was hashed out and 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 he should have clarified a lot of his comments on that. Um, I think his point was always he was talking about. So so when he was talking to a lot of women, they were talking about they want million dollar men. And he said, well, when, if you're getting a most of he said most of the time when you're getting a man that's making over a million dollars a year, they want a submissive woman. He's not saying that's what it should be but he was saying that's what you should expect if you want that kind of guy and you're coming from you know like if you're not both making the same you know like he had like his whole explanation that you can watch his videos on that but i get what she's saying here i don't know what made her say this but you know it is what it is and you know she's 
everyone has a right to their opinion and what they want to say and what they want to preach to women or preach to guys you know so it is what it is and you got to take you got to discern which is the best advice for you in your situation anyways this is jordan tower with jt news i appreciate you guys and i will check you guys on the next one